Hey I'm fellow pips, welcome back to the channel. If it's your first time here, welcome. I've had a request. I've had a request to have a look at one of the functions that are in the uh, Fujifilm X-T4. And that function is the ability to automatically focus stack your images. Now, there's a strange way that the camera actually tells you and it can be a little bit misleading and confusing. It's not difficult but the way it reads, it looks and sounds very difficult, but it isn't. And you think, why is it not working? And it's because you're probably just not realizing the instructions because they are very confusing. So first things first, get yourself a nice subject. For me, it's these, these lovely flowers. Um, I hope there's not too much of a, a reflection there. It seems okay. Um, I hope you're picking this up all right. Um, but this is how we do it. This is it. This is it. The first thing you need to do for this procedure is to make sure your drive setting is in bracket. Okay, see that? Just make sure it's in bracket. Then you need to enter your menu system, go across to your little camera icon there, then shoot over to the right for drive settings. Then once again, press to the right, select your your own um, bracket settings and then just push up to get your focus bracketing. Then hit it, hit it again for the auto. Now the intervals, now what this is going to give you is the amount of spare time in between each operation of the shutter. So if you want a little bit of time for maybe a flash to regenerate or maybe you're using some sort of other syncing device. For me, I don't need anything. There's plenty of light, everything's set up lovely. And that is basically it. But if you wanted a, a two second gap in between each frame, then you will get a two second gap. And that gives you the option up to 10 seconds. I don't know what that would possibly be for. Maybe like I say, if you are using some sort of flash system. So once you've done that, you're happy with your settings. It's literally just auto and then your intervals. Back to your picture. Now you've got a different, different thing to look at here. Now you're in manual focus. I want you to select where you want to focus. For me, it's going to start just here. And as I turn the focus ring on the lens, you can see how it highlights just because that is what I've got it chosen to. Uh, you can have all different sorts of focus mechanisms within the camera, such as split screen and many other things. I just like to use this focus peaking system. It's, it's really good. So once you've set your point A, just hit the OK and the menu button. Now you've got to select your end, <laughs> which will be, for me, in fact, I might... Mm, so this is going to be a hell of a lot of images. A hell of a lot. Look at it, how it's going up there. See, it's going right. See, I'm just, I'm just watching here. So that's going to be my depth of field there. And what this is now going to do, I'm hoping it's not going to be many more than 50 images. Um, instead of hitting the menu and the OK button, this is where people are getting confused. Uh, I did myself. Uh, it's easily done. Instead of hitting the OK menu button, you don't need to do that to enter your B selection. You hit the back and the display button and you keep doing that until you're back to where you first started. Now, this is just a, an opinion of mine. Hit your uh, two second timer. If you've not seen the video for creating shortcuts in the X-T3, X-T4. Have a look, it's really interesting because it's just gonna aid you with your photographer. Once you've done that, you basically just smash the shutter button. We're gonna get our two second count. 200 images just to fill that.
So if you have ever wondered how somebody can get an image that sharp from the very smallest flower in an image right back to that castle that's far away in the landscape, then this is exactly how they do that. So with that said and done, I hope this video's helped in some way, shape or form. And uh, there's one thing left to do. And <laughs> let's get out and shoot, guys. You know you want to. Okay, cheers. I'll see you soon. Take care.